Hey guys, gossip and reactions, moristic. Terroristic threat possibly targeting Travis Kelsey delays Morgan Wallen concert. Is this realistic? Is this serious, guys? Why would people want to attack Travis Kelsey? He's a football player in love with Taylor Swift. A Morgan Wallen concert goer has been arrested for making a terroristic threat at the country singer's Kansas City show on Friday. An Illinois man has been charged with a felony after he threatened on social media to shoot two individuals at a concert Friday night at Arrowhead in Kansas City. A statement from the Jackson County prosecutors read, 23-year-old Aaron Brown's alleged targets were members of the Kansas City Chiefs organization and were present at the event. The statement continued. The concert was delayed some 40 minutes while Brown was located and taken into custody. Per the Kansas City Star, Brown described his tweet to police as a stupid, stupid mistake and that he did not know why he had shared it. His girlfriend, who was also questioned, suggests that he had done so because of his support for a viral football team. She added that she had taught him not to tweet almost always the best advice after all but he did so anyway brown's post was later deleted hmm while the prosecutor's statement did not identify the chief's player allegedly targeted by name both patrick mohans and travis kelsey were in attendance and accompanied well and during his signature dressing room workout when the show eventually began. The three men can be seen kicking off proceedings and a video wall and posted to TikTok. I don't understand what's going on with people. I don't understand why people are trying to delete or hurt other people just because you don't like what they do. You don't like their uh, status in the social media or what they do for a living. Like if you have a musical life, you don't know what to do with yourself seek help but don't try to erase somebody don't try to hurt somebody just because you don't like their political view or you don't like what they stand for you don't like what they're doing for a living whether it's music rapping uh, acting or football or basketball soccer whatever it is to which is on we are all here doing different things earn our living in different ways so why are you so mad why are you so angry that you have to take it on somebody else's life, man? Enough is enough. After the uh, attempted assassination of the former president, Donald Trump, which we don't condemn, we got to take shit serious these days. I am glad he tweeted it. At least people were able to know what's in his mind, whether it was a joke or not. We cannot be playing with shit like that anymore. We can't. And I am praying so hardly for VP Kamala Harris. I am afraid for her life. I am so effing scared for her life. Knowing the kind of country we live in. Knowing what these idiots can choose to do. Hearing how this former president is so sure of himself will be elected president. These things are things that really keep me awake at night time. I don't want nobody to harm anybody, but you don't know what's in their effing heads, man. You just don't know. All I can hope for that she gets the best protection that any human being can afford. Ah, there are such hatred, hateful people out there. The mega court will do anything. Okay? And what this former president is saying right now is... Mm, disgusting outrageous and i can hope nothing protection protection for vp kamala harris because it's too much going on right now subscribe let me know how you feel thank you for watching bye